Hey guys and welcome, Grim Reaper here. We got ourselves another trailer reaction. We got ourselves Escape Room Tournament of Champions. Now, with a title like that, you're like, wait a minute. We only had one Escape Room. You know, they never, you know, I think this title would have made sense with, you know, like maybe be the fourth or fifth movie into the franchise. You get all the people who survived that one and then thrown in there. Um, you know, but, you know, or at least give us, I don't know. We only saw one Escape Room person uh, from the for the first one survive so she's coming back for the next one supposedly because it's you know tournament of champions but you know if you only have one champion that we know of are we going to get a backstory of the other ones you know how they became champions because i think that's a lot of time that's that they, that you know they're going to or there should be like an exposition or a quick you know flash of other people who survived and you know with our little quick backstory of them surviving which could basically take about five, six minutes of uh, screen time, which won't be much a lot, or they're gonna actually take a long length of screen time to explain it, which can hurt you a lot. But uh, we'll have to wait and see, or at least I have to wait and see. Let's jump into this trailer and uh, see uh, let's see what this does. I enjoyed the first one. I thought the first one was decent. It wasn't great, but I saw potential of it being better. You were lucky to get out of those escape rooms alive. I need to know. Oh, that's right. He's right, right too. Four people in front of me are held accountable. Hiding in plain sight in the middle of Manhattan. We need to stop them. I'm in. Huh. I know this is a lot to ask, but thank you for coming with me. Oh, Jesus. Hey, what the hell is going on? The train is uncoupled. Oh, you're screwed. You're so screwed. You gotta be kidding me. Oh. Fuck that. That's what? gotta hurt. You guys have played the game before? So what is this? Like a tournament of champions? That was... We all know how this works. Come on. We solve the puzzles or we die. Ah! False advertising must be pulled. This ad? Yourself is missing an E. So maybe we pull the corresponding handles with a missing letter. Yes! E. Oh, sweet Jesus. Come on, we don't have time! The missing letters are W, B, and O! This is way bigger than last time. You, you think something, right? No, 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 no. You dumbass. There's a special reason each of us survived. I can't feel physical pain. Just imagine the kinds of puzzles they came up with for me. Take a picture, it will last longer. Get the clue. This looks just like the lighthouse on the postcard. Huh. That Oof. It's over. I'm done running. We can beat them at their own game. What makes you think they're gonna let you walk away free again? We can take it! Stop! We're gonna get us killed. I'm not playing your game! Oh, not sweet yet. Jesus. Not ever! We need it. Nope. We I don't understand. We're still on the game. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, definitely, definitely looks enjoyable. Um, The premise of this is, like, you know, what people could probably compare it to Saw, but it's not really. It kind of reminds me of, um... Oh, what's the movie? There's another movie where you... Oh, Jesus, where is what? It's not Saw. Not Hustle. Well, it's kind of like Hustle and Saw put together because there's a uh, like in hustle how they had rich people you know picking certain people they wanted to torture stuff like that well instead of them picking certain people well these certain people were pretty picked so them you know they don't we don't know if it's uh people betting on it or you know picking people they want to pay to torture or kill or is it people getting picked at random or whatever reason they get picked are people betting on who would survive in the background that we don't know about or what who is the nameless who is the nameless corporation behind this that's getting these people and putting them in these Really mess up situations. Uh, so it's kind of like a, a mix of Saw and uh, um, Hustle kind of put together with elements of those just kind of taken out, stripped it out, took some basic uh, parts of those and put into this. I, you know, the first one was kind of okay. This one, you know, it could be good, could be not. I'm not too sure. Like I said, I kind of enjoyed the first one. It wasn't like, you know, oh my God, it was amazing. It was just kind of like, all right, you know, wasn't bad, wasn't great. Just, I enjoyed it. And, yeah, I don't know how this one's going to turn out. You know, some of the traps definitely look more elaborate. You definitely had to kick it up a notch. 
but I'm not too sure. That sand one reminds me of the uh, the frozen the frozen part of the first in the first one where you're in the frozen uh, uh, escape room. That one that one sucked. The, the room getting hot too in that the, the open part of it. I don't know. There's a lot of cool you know charts that they had came up with, but yeah. We'll see how this turns out. Can it be good? Can it be grappy? But I don't know. We're going to have to wait and find out. Let me know what you guys thought about this trailer. Did you like the first movie? Did you enjoy it? You're like, man, this was really solid. I think it was a really good idea. I'm glad they made a second one. Or you're kind of like, ah, oh, it should have been just one and done. Or you're like, the first one, like, I didn't like the first one. The first one was just horrible. Where did you stand? Where do you stand? Let me know, and I'll see you guys around for more. All right, guys, you take care. Bye.